Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Good evening. How was your day? No much rain today? It was not too rainy today? Here, no, in Zacatecolica, no. Well, at Good. 3, at 3 p.m., yes, but some minutes. The, the normal, the normal rain. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, it seems that there are enough people now. I will start. Uh, they asked me to show you this first. Am I sharing a video? Yes? yes yeah. Okay. Wait, because I have to start the video at the same time here and here. Because I don't know why. When I share videos here in this computer, they cannot be listened. So I have to put it in this computer and in another one with, with a speaker. But in order to do that, I have to start both videos at the same time. Okay, go ahead.
para la comunicación de los programas de formación por lenguaje inclusivo y no sexista y la guía metodológica para la prevención y erradicación de la discriminación contra las mujeres. Dichos documentos fueron elaborados con el enfoque de derechos humanos y de género, estableciendo medidas que garanticen relaciones de respeto, igualdad y equidad entre todas las personas que forman parte y conviven en los centros de formación profesional. De esta forma, el INSEPUR asume la igualdad de género como un principio transversal de trabajo, entregando a los centros de formación estas cuatro herramientas que complementan la guía para la prevención y erradicación de la discriminación contra las mujeres, a fin de que sean puestas en práctica en beneficio de las usuarias de la formación profesional. INSEPUR, formando en igualdad. Ok. Well, that's the way they want you to know a little bit about what INSAFOR is. That means that you can get into other courses, not only English. You have several opportunities there. And this is me. Okay. And we are going to start now. Uh, how many of you already start in the platform? Okay, Jancy. Do you have any doubts about the platform so far? No? No, yet. Okay. Anybody? No. Well, uh, I have seen the platform and uh, today is like a reinforcement for you about what you are working on the platform. If you have any doubts while we are going through this, just let me know. And we are going to check uh, in the platform uh, the exercises that you have to do. So if you haven't done it yet, you may open uh, the, the platform in your computer and have the exercises open in order to do it at the same time that we are going to do it here. That is called um, legal cheating <laughs> because I am giving you the answers. Well, we are going to agree on the answers, okay? Now, somebody could read the thought for today. Uh, Giselle, please. Daría a comprender mejor nuestro planeta. También está muy cerca Wait. del cinturón de asteroides de nuestro sistema solar. Para algunas personas, ir a... Ok. Sorry. Go ahead. Ok. Uh, education is not the learning of facts but the training of the mind uh, to think. Okay. Uh, Albert Einstein, okay. Uh, any comments about the thought for today? No comments? No. What do you understand about it? Do you agree with it? Yes, in my case, I, uh, I'm totally agree with the, uh, with the phrases um, because I think that when we are learning 
something. It's not only uh, it's not only that we need to memorize. We need to put in practice in, in the life. Yes, completely. For example, uh, I am an English teacher, but I also have given other subjects uh, in the school and in high school. And when I taught uh, social studies in high school, I gave I gave my students the difference the the different positions from the story from where you can see the story uh, for example we were talking about uh, the war in el salvador but i gave them the point of view of the militaries and the point of view of the guerrilla and also the point of view of the population, because there were different points of view and even international point of view. And according to me, we were not more than a chess board for the big nations, for Russia and the United States. And we were like a chess board for them and they were like, well, I, I am with the government and then I will be with the left, left side. And let's see, instead of, instead of uh, doing our war with uh, atomic bombs, we will be, uh, playing here, okay? We were like a, a chess board for them. I say it that way, okay? Because if you really think we were, we were uh, in a war almost um, friends against friends because some friends were taken by the um, by the army and some friends were taken by guerrillas and they had to fight each other against each other because uh, the army makes the 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 people uh, to have a military um, career or or they 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 make them soldiers and the gorilla do the same so and just for something that the guerrilla, some of them didn't know why they were fighting for. I know it because I talked to them. I had friends that were in the guerrilla. And they just, because they were young and they want to fight and they, had, they want to have a gun or whatever. And in my case, I said, what is how can I say that blow a beautiful bridge that we have from uh, the central part of the country to the oriental part of the country was a good thing to do? Because we had a very beautiful bridge there. It was almost like the Golden Gate, but in small, okay? But that's life. And now the ones that were fighting, now they are friends. Imagine. Well, then I don't tell them what to think. I just give them the facts and let them think 
what they can uh, comprehend about the, the facts of life, okay? Because we are going to look for the truth, but my truth is one, your truth is another one, but we can talk and find another way to see the things because not a single person is the owner of the truth. Each of us has a, a different perspective of life. And we had to, uh, to get into agreements. Okay. Now, lesson objective. In this lesson, participants will learn how to introduce themselves and others by listening to a conversation between two people who just met and are introducing each other. Okay, let's see. Hello everyone and welcome to the pre-intermediate course. This is section one. Please call me. Participants will learn how to introduce themselves and others by listening to a conversation between two people who just met and are introducing each other. Hi everyone, welcome to this class. We we'll learn how to introduce ourselves and others. For you to learn how to do so, you need to listen to the following audio program. Remember that you may listen to the audio as many times as you need to and don't forget to practice it as well. Let's pay attention. Hello, I'm David Garza. I'm a new club member. Hi, my name is Elizabeth Silva, but please call me Beth. Okay, where are you from, Beth? Brazil, how about you? I'm from Mexico. Oh, I love Mexico. It's really beautiful. Thanks, so is Brazil. Oh, good, Sun He is here. Who's Sun He? She's my classmate. We're in the same math class. Where's she from? Korea. Let's go and say hello. Sorry, what's your last name again? Garcia? Actually, it's Garza. How do you spell that? G-A-R-Z-A. -A. Okay, again. I'm a new club. Let's pay attention. Hello, I'm David Garza. I'm a new club member. Hi, my name is Elizabeth Silva, but please call me Beth. Okay, where are you from, Beth? Brazil, how about you? I'm from Mexico. Oh, I love Mexico. It's really beautiful. Thanks, so is Brazil. Oh, good, Sun He is here. Who's Sun He? She's my classmate. We're in the same math class. Where's she from? Korea. Let's go and say hello. Sorry, what's your last name again? Garcia? Actually, it's Garza. How do you spell that? G-A-R-Z-A. -A. Okay. Now, if you notice, they are introducing each other. Uh, David says hello and says his name and last name. And then Beth say her name and how he can call her, okay? Then they have an informal conversation asking where they are from and giving the answer. And then she see uh, one of her friends or classmates and she wants to introduce Sonhi to David, okay? So, any questions about vocabulary?
No. No, no questions? Okay, now repeat after me. Hello, I'm David Garza. Hello, Hello I'm, I'm David, David Garza. Garza. I'm a new club member. I'm, I'm a new, new club, club member. member. Hi, my name is Elizabeth Silva. Hi, Hi. My, my name is Elizabeth Silva. Silva. But please call me Beth. But, but, but please call me Beth. Me Beth. Okay, where are you from, Beth? Okay. 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 Where are you from, Beth? Brazil, how about you? Brazil. Brazil. I'm from Mexico. I'm, I'm from, from Mexico. 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 Oh, I love Mexico. Oh, oh, yeah. oh I, I love, love Mexico. Mexico. It's really beautiful. It's, it's really, really beautiful. beautiful. Really beautiful. Thanks. So is Brazil. Thanks. 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 Oh, good. So oh, he good. is here. Oh, good. Oh, good. Oh, good. Oh, good. Oh, good. Oh, good. Who is Sanhi? Who is Who is Sanhi? She is my classmate. She is my classmate. We're in the same class. We're in the same math class. We're in the same math class. Where is she from? Where is she from? Where is she from? Korea. 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 Let's go and say hello. Let's go, Let's go, and, go, go and say hello. hello. Sorry, what's your last name again? Sorry. 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 What's your last name again? again. Garcia. 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 Actually, it's Garza. Actually, actually, actually it's Garza. Garza. How do you spell that? How do you, How do you, spell, do you that? spell that? G A R G G A R Okay. Now, uh, we are about 26 people, I guess. No, 24 now. Um, I need volunteers. Volunteers. Yes. Okay, Katia and Jancy. Hi. Okay. Is there a is, is there a man? No. Just girls. Okay, girls power now. <laughs> uh, are you going to do this with those names or are you going to put your own name? You can use your own name, it's better because uh, that way you also practice with your name, okay? Now, uh, Jancy, you are David, and Katia, you are Beth, but you may introduce yourself with your names, okay? Go ahead. Okay. 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 Hello, Katia, I'm Jancy Melendez, and... I'm in English class. No, I'm a new. Follow me. Okay. I'm the rest, the rest ah. the same. Just your name. Hello, no, no. Okay. okay. Hello, I'm Jancy Melendez. I'm a new club member. Hi, my name is Katia Serrano, but please call me Kate. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you from, Kate? 
Brazil. How about you? I'm from Mexico. Oh, I love Mexico. It's really beautiful. Thanks. So is Brazil. Oh, good. Uh, some he is here. Who is some he? She's my classmate. We're in the same math class. Where is she from? Korea. Let's go and say hello. Sorry, what's your last name again? Mendes? <laughs> Actually, it's Melendez. How do you spell that? M E L E N D E C. Excellent. <laughs> you did it well. Okay. Now, other two volunteers. Other two volunteers. Okay. Elizabeth, you are going to be Beth. And Natalie, you are going to be David. Go ahead. Hello. I'm Natalie Miranda. I'm a new club member. Hi, my name is Elizabeth Mejia, but please call me Betty. Okay. Where are you from? It's Elizabeth also, Beth. Ah, okay. 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 Where are you from, Beth? Brazil, how about you? I'm from Mexico. Oh, Mexico. I love Mexico. It's really beautiful. Thanks. So, is Brazil? Oh, good. So, is it here? Who is on here? She's my classmate. We're in the same math class. Where is she from? Korea. Let's go and say hello. Sorry, what's your last name again? Uh, okay. <laughs> Rivera? Actually, it's Miranda. How do you spell that? M-I-R-A-N-D-A. Um, okay, thank you very much. Now, other two volunteers. Eden Nilsson and... Hi, teacher. And Jessica, okay. Eden Nilsson first and Jessica next. Okay. And, and sorry, the ones that are not participating, uh, could mute them uh, yourself, please? Just the ones that uh, are participating will be with the uh, microphones open. Thank you. Okay, go ahead. Eden Nils, on you first? Yes, uh, okay. Hello, I'm Eden Nils Garcia. I'm a new club member. Hi, my name is Jessica Castro, but please call me Jesse. <laughs> okay, where are you from? Jesse. Brazil, how about you? I'm from Mexico. Oh, I love Mexico. It's really beautiful. Thanks. Thanks. And next slide, please. Yes. Thanks. So, who is Brazil? Uh, 
Some oh, key. good. Some key. Some key is here. Who is Sung Hee? She's my She's math classmate. Class We're in the same math class. Where is she from? Korea. Korea. Let's, Let's go and go. say hello. So Sorry, what's your last name again? again? Garcia? Garcia? No, in this, in this case, it will be different because he is Garcia. You may say Garza now. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Sorry, what's your last name again? Garza? Actually, it's Garcia. Okay. How do you spell that? G A R C I A. Okay, thank you very much. Now, other two volunteers, Rafael and Ana Margarita. Go ahead, Rafael. Hello. I am Rafael Amaya. I am a new club member. My name, hi, my name is Ana Margarita Marquez. Good place, good meet Ana. Okay, where is you from, Ana? That's it, how about you? I'm from Mexico. No, no. Oh, hello. Rafael is from Mexico. Rafael? I am from Mexico. Okay, now you, Ana. Oh, I I love you, Mexico. Mexico is really beautiful. Thing, so is Brazil. Oh, good. Who is here? Who is so here? She, she is my class. We say math class. Where is she from? Korea. Let's go. I sang hello. Sorry. What you like? My name again. Am I? Actually, it's Amaya. How do you sleep stop? A, A M A G A. Y. 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 A. Y. A. Okay. A. Thank you very much. Now, other two volunteers. Okay, Sofia and Bella. Go ahead, Sofia, you're first. Okay. Hello, I'm Sofia Castaneda. I am new club member. Hi, my name is Bella Lorena Reyes, but you can, but please call me Lore. Okay, where are you from? Uh, what is your name? Lore, Lore. 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 Where are you from, Lore? Brazil. How about you? I'm from Mexico. Oh, I love Mexico. It's really beautiful. Thanks. So is Brazil. Oh, good. So he is here. Uh, who is soon he? She's my classmate. We are in the same math class. Hey, where is she, she from? Korea. Let's go and say hello. 
Sorry, what's your last name again? Castro? <laughs> Actually, it's Castaneda. How do you spell that? C A E C A A D L. No, no, no. C A E S T A N E D A. Okay. It's S S S C A S C A S. Okay. S okay. Every time when you spell uh, uh, long things, you have to divide them three by three, okay? C-A-S-T-A-N-E-D-A, -A -E -A, okay? Three by three. It's, it's easier and it sounds more, okay, regular. Three, three letters by, and three letters. Yes, three by okay. three, okay? Now, thank you very much. You are doing so great. Anyone that wants to practice? Okay, Giselle, who else? No one wants to be with, okay, Natalie. Giselle and Natalie. Go ahead, you said you first. Uh, okay. Hello, I'm Carmen Canales. I'm in a new club member. Hi, uh, my name is Natalia Ayala, but please call me Natalie. Okay. Okay, uh, where are you from, Natalie? Brazil, how about you? I'm from Mexico. Oh, I love Mexico. It's really beautiful. Tent, so is Brazil. Oh, good. Sanji is here. Who is Sanji? She's my classmate. We're in the same math class. Where is she from? Korea. Let's go and say hello. Sorry, what's your last name again? Gracia or something? Actually, it's Canales. How do you spell that? C A N A L E S. Okay, thank you very much. Now, no more volunteers? No? Okay, go ahead. Thank you, you are doing very well. I'm glad that you like to participate. Now, by the end of this lesson, participants will be able to understand and use possessive adjectives. My, your, his, her, its, our, their, in order to introduce their names and to express position. And let me tell you that possessive adjectives, since they are adjectives, they always go with, an, with a noun, okay? Because an adjective is a, is a word that uh, delimitates a noun. So we, when we are using these possessive adjectives, we always uh, get it with a noun. For example, my name or my book, my mother, okay? You always use it with a noun, okay? Here, statements with, I'm from Mexico, repeat please. I'm from Mexico. 
The contraction I'm I'm means I am. I am. The possessive for the first person singular is my. 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 You're from Brazil. You're from Brazil. You're. You are. You are. You are. The possessive adjective is your. 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 He's from Japan. He's from Japan. His. His. He is. He is. His. 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 She's a new club member. She is a new, new club, club member. 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 She's. 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 She is. She is. She is. She is. Her. 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 It's an exciting city. It is it's an exciting, exciting city. city. It's it is it is it is it is it's it is it's it we're in the same class we're, we're in, in the same class, class. Same same class. class. We're, we're we're we are we are, we are. they they oh, excuse me our. Uh, the possessive our. adjective for we is our. 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 Now, uh, the last one. They're my classmates. They're my classmates. They're. They're. They are. They are. They are. They are. They are. And the possessive adjective is they're. They're. Okay. Now, any questions about this? This is the contraction of the subject and the verb to be. Okay, in simple, in affirmative, uh, simple present. Affirmative, simple present. Now, the knowledge check. As I told you, remember, you can have your you can have your platform open and work together in order to be uh, on time with your with your exercises. Remember that the first week that means from today to when, to, in this case, to Friday, we will be covering two sections, okay? Section one and two. Then the next, the next week, we will be covering section three and the middle term exam, okay? The third week, we will be covering the fourth section and the last week we will be covering fifth the fifth section and the final test okay now let's mm -hmm. see a knowledge check 1.4 statements with b and possessive adjectives now, um, Jancy, could you read the instructions, please? Okay. Instructions. Complete this sentence by choosing the preferred form of B or the correct possessive adjectives. Okay. Thank you very much. Now, um, Elizabeth, you will, you will uh, read 
and select the right answer. And then you will choose who will continue. Okay, who will make number two. But now do number one. My name is David Garza. Okay, my name is David Garza. Choose your classmate, please. <laughs> Pardon? Choose um, Rafael. Escoja, escoja, ah, okay. Rafael, Rafael, Rafael you're called. Number two. My brother, uh, no, I'm sorry. I am from family is in the city, Mexico, Mexico City. I'm My, from Mexico. I'm from Mexico. Mm -hmm. my, my family is in Mexico City. Okay, thank you very much. Choose another classmate. Anna. Hmm. Anna. Number three. My my brother uh -huh. is my brother, my brother is, is a university student. University university student. Okay. University student. If you notice here it says a university student. Remember that the use mm -hmm. of a and an both means the same, but we use a before consonant sounds and we use an before vowel sounds but pay attention sounds because if you notice this is a, a vowel but it's not a vowel sound it's not a sound it's a vowel but it doesn't uh, sound as a vowel it sounds G, university, okay? That's why we use A, okay? The, the, the rule says sounds, and even though that is a vowel, we use A, not an, because it doesn't sound U. It sounds you, okay? okay? Then my brother is, is a, a university. university. A university. If this sounds u, it will be an, like umbrella, an umbrella, an umbrella. But in this case, it's you, university, okay? Now choose another classmate. Please, Sara. Okay, Sara. Yeah. Is our hair or his? Sara. Hello. Sarah is not here. Choose another one. In the chat, this is. Ah, she has problems with sound, but she's a smart. Okay. His. His name is Carlos. Now, uh, choose another classmate or volunteer, any volunteer. Mm. Okay, go ahead, Jessica. Mm. Yes. My. My sister. My name. My name My is Tonghi Park. 
My name is Sonhi Park. I'm 20 years old. Okay, thank you very much. Now choose a classmate. To do number six. Emma. Sorry? Emma. 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 Number six, Emma. Mm. Okay, mm. don't worry, Sara. Is mm. okay. Number six, Emma. Yeah. My sister is is a student here. Read it. My sister is a student here too. Our parents are in Korea right now. Okay, thank you very much. Choose. Another victim. <laughs> Nancy Portillo wants to read. Go ahead, Nancy. I am Elizabeth, but everyone calls me Beth. My last name is Silva. Okay, thank you very much. Choose another one. Okay, volunteers for number eight. Okay, let's see. Uh, number eight, Katia, and number nine, Reina. Okay. Hey, teacher. I I'm a student at City College. Okay, I guess that they are still talking about. Okay, okay, okay. Now, number nine. My parents are in Canada on vacation this week. On vacation this week. Okay, thank you very much. Let's see. Okay, correct. See, everybody has it. Todos lo tienen? Yes. 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 Okay. Sure. Now we know that we are all correct. Let's continue. Oh. Now lesson objective. By the end of this lesson, participants will be able to ask and answer questions with B using WH questions words, what, who, where, when, and how. Okay, now repeat after me. What's your name? What's your, your, name? What's your, your name? name? What's your name? My name is Beth. My, my name, name is Beth. Beth. Where's your friend? Where's, Where's your, your friend? friend? He's in class. He's in class. class. Who's son he? Who's son he? She's my classmate. She's my classmate. What are your classmates like? What are They're very nice. They're very nice. Very nice. Where are you and Luisa from? Where are you and Luisa from? We're from Brazil. We're from Brazil. How are your classes? How, How are your classes? They're really interesting. They're really interesting. Okay. When we use WH questions words, we want to know more information. There for your answer cannot be only yes or no. We had two types 
of main uh, questions, the yes, no questions, and the WH questions. Yes, no questions, you may answer yes, yes or no. Yes, I do, no, I don't, or yes, I have, no, I haven't, or whatever they ask you. You just have to follow that you have to use yes or no in the, the subject and the auxiliary, okay, according to the question. And, but in the case of WH questions, you cannot just answer yes or no because you have to give information. That's why they are always, they are also known as information questions. Then it is necessary to know the meaning of each word to know what you're being asked. This way you will be able to give a correct answer. For example, uh, the yes no questions could be the base for a WH questions. For example, uh, if I ask you, do you study? You may answer yes I do or no I don't, okay? But if I ask you, why do you study? You have to give me the reason. And then you have to answer, because I want to improve, okay? And, or any reason that you have to study. Then uh, I may ask you, where do you study? And then you have to give me the place where you study. If I ask you, how much do you study? Then you have to give me an amount of time or amount of uh, material that you study. If you notice, I am using the same base, do you study? But I am changing the WH word and that changes the information I want to be provided for, okay? Now, this is not in the platform. That's my own for you, okay? And then it says, who? We ask who with people. For example, who is that? The answer, it's Jack. What? with things, what are you looking for? Then the answer, a pen. When, with time, when are you leaving? At six, where, with places, where do you live? In that house, which to make choices, which blouse do you want? The red one, why? Asking for reason. Why do you come? Because, okay. How long? Time. How long will it take? 15 minutes. How far? Distance. How far is the school? Three kilometers. How much? Amount. How much does it cost? $15. How many? Quantity. How many pupusas do you want? And I, I, and I answer three. If this, if the one that answers this will be my, my, my youngest son, he will say six for starting. <laughs> he loves to eat pupusas. <laughs> and I made very big pupusas and he ate for starting six. And then if he wants more, he asks for more. And he used to be very thin. Now he is getting a little bit more. Okay. Now, any questions about this? We have more. We have more. But these ones are the more useful. Okay. Do you have any questions about this? No? No. No. Okay. 
We no, have also have... we have also whose and whom. Whose is like asking for a owner. For example, whose blouse is this? If I found a blouse in, in, in my room that is not mine, I may ask, whose blouse is this? O sea, ¿de quién es esta blusa? Uh, there are others, but these are the ones that we use the most. Now we are going to make the knowledge check and that will be the end of it. Okay, let's see. Almost on time. Okay. Now let's check. WH questions with B. Now, Rafael Cruz, please read the instructions. Instruction complete uh, complete complete times question using WH question word uh, clip on the the correct answer. Okay, thank you. Now remember these these these, these, these questions. Question. These questions because this is for plural. This is for singular, is T-H-I-S. But in this case, it's this, it's long, this. Okay, now, uh, Katia Elizabeth, please do number one. Okay, teacher. Who's that? Who's that, okay? Cannot be where, cannot be how, because they are saying that's miss. Talk about a person. Okay, is asking for a person. Thank you. Now, another volunteer. Okay, Jan. Where she's. Okay. Okay. Where is she from? She's from Miami. Okay, Natalie. What's, what's her first name? It's Celia. Okay, thank you very much. Now, uh, Sophia. Okay. Uh, uh, who are, and see, who are the, no, what are? Mm -mm. Who are? Mm -hmm. Okay. Who are? The two student over there. Mm -hmm. Their names? Their names are Jeremy and Karen. Okay, thank you very much. Now, Eden Nilsson. Where are they from? They're from? Vancouver, Canada. Okay, thank you very much. Now, Jessica Alejandra. How are they like? Mm -hmm. They're shy, but very friendly. Okay, thank you very much. Let's see. Okay, correct. You have all correct. Okay. Everybody has done it? Everybody has done it? Yes. 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 Okay. Yes. yes. Okay, thank you very much. See you tomorrow, the same time. Remember this week, we will be finishing in on Friday because we skipped yesterday. Okay. okay, take care. Okay.
Okay, bye, 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 bye,